Yo, 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 what is going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It is your boy, The Wolf of Crypto here, bringing you guys another video today. Got another Star Atlas update video here. Uh, we'll be choosing our faction here today, folks. I'll definitely be choosing my faction. Kind of have an idea um, of which faction I'll be participating with. Um, and it's because, you know, I did some digging, uh, got a chance to read some of their articles, and I would suggest that you, you know, do your due diligence before you actually choose your faction as well. Um, but let's further ado, let's go ahead and let's dive on in, right? Uh, we go ahead and connect the wallet. Um, soul extension. God, I love it. And I'm definitely going to be looking to obviously buy some more resources here uh, before the game, obviously, is fully launched, uh, beta wise, stuff like that. Um, but for me, uh, I think the faction that I'm going to choose is going to be the Uster Builders. Um, and there's a couple of reasons. Um, and like I said, if you guys haven't had a chance to kind of read through uh, which faction, what they kind of do and what they're all about, um, I would highly suggest you guys do that. Uh, as far as this particular group, you know, they are the Android group. Um, so they're more so, I guess their whole goal the most part is to you know build on all these different um territories uh you know gathering parts and then selling them to you know different space explorers that uh come through uh the planet i mean the builders i'm not gonna lie i think what really got me uh to kind of choose this faction is the fact that you're kind of like the middleman in a sense i mean you're not really doing too much battle you're more so trying to create an empire on land and um you having a chance to you know kind of like you know uh create like your own bar um and there's some other like production um like r d anything for like ships um a lot of different things that you can kind of mix and match and try to figure out you know what type of resources do i want to build that way when you know, space explorers where they can come to wherever, you know, I may be in the metaverse, I can offer them a variety of services, right? So if they need some gas, fuel, ship repairs, or ship upgrades, where they can be, you know, these are pretty much the staple of these guys. So for me, like I said, I went through this, and I went through each of them, because, you know, you got the mud, uh, mud faction. Um, these are basically kind of the explorers um of the galaxy these this particular faction they're you know they're out to explore and find new territories find new uh undiscovered uh planets stuff like that and then also too you got the oni fighters and these guys i got a feel after obviously reading some of this uh these guys are the these are the combat people these are the guys that are coming in here uh, looking to fight, do ambushes, you know, try and probably steal some loot and all that stuff. Um, so this particular faction is more so if you're trying to get that, you know, first hand-to-hand -hand combat or even spaceship to spaceship combat, this is a particular uh, faction that's probably going to be for you, um, obviously. So this is another thing to kind of take some notes, um, being a landowner, what that kind of looks like and also to some different things to kind of keep in mind if you are going to be obviously doing uh, this. The land is owned and it can also be lost. So that's something that you keep in mind. I'm um, sorry, Atlas utilizes an innovative land value tax uh, to prevent flipping as well as to incentivize users to make use of their land parcels. And then players can sell land, buy land, collect taxes, <laughs> collect taxes, right? Or use it as collateral for loans. And then land parcels can be acquired in the primary markets through auction or in secondary markets where landowners can sell their land parcels in exchange for Atlas. Um, and then, you know, it talks about how to set up an extraction in mine. I mean, like I said, the game itself and all the in-game features that it has and the economy and just everything that you're going to be able to do as a player playing this game. It's, it's crazy. It's insane. I'm looking forward to it, but like I said, I'm going to go ahead and choose my faction. Um, let's go ahead and do that. We're going to be the Uster. The Uster. 
it kind of gives you a little brief little introduction of each faction and obviously what they're all about and like i said this is who i'm choosing uh and obviously it says you know this is permanent here folks so uh obviously i'll have to use my influence to trade with other people in other factions uh so definitely uh leave some comments down below to let me know which faction you guys are in because like i said i'm I'm probably gonna be your guys' guy as far as oh wow didn't even do that. I'm probably gonna be like your guys' mill man, like I said uh, between different factions. Obviously now I am part of the sector. I am part of the androids, um, and that's pretty much it. So it looks like I'll be able to edit my avatar now. Um, I'll be able to edit my badge. So I don't have any badges right now, and then I can choose my ooh. Choose my avatar, so I'm gonna go ahead and choose my avatar, update this, prove. There's your boy. No organization quite yet. I can always do my country later. But well, that's pretty much it here, folks. I am part of the Uster faction. I'll be a builder, a landowner, I'll be doing all that. So like I said, um, if you get, if you guys need somebody, like I said, come. Come talk to me. Come see me in the metaverse. Uh, and as far as like inventory goes, like I was saying, I, I definitely gotta buy some more structures. Uh, gotta get some more ships, definitely. Um, but like I said, man, this is exciting times. They've added some um, new things to the collectibles. So like they got these, uh, what are they have these little patches. They got these body suits, um, different skins, and you get you a pet. I mean. Whew. seems like every time uh, there's an update that comes out or basically anything in the news about Star Atlas that comes out, it's always um, catching your attention. But that's going to wrap it up for this particular Star Atlas update video. Like I said, you can choose your faction. Again, I am part of the Uster faction. I want to try to see if I can reshow it. Yep, kind of leaderboards. And these are all the different territories, or I say factions. They don't have organizations yet. Obviously they can still show players, but like I said, I am part of the Uster sector. Total asset value is pretty big, obviously compared to the mud territory. Um, those are the guys, like I said, that are looking to explore the metaverse. But that's going to wrap it up as far as this particular video goes. Again, if you guys did enjoy this content, found it useful, please leave a thumbs up, share with your friends. Also, too, if you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Also, hit that bell to be notified for future videos. And uh, until next time, y'all, take care.